Welcome back to my channel. Um, I know I've been away for a while. It's been a long couple of months with I moved and then the whole coronavirus thing happened. So it's, it's, it's been a long time. Um, but because of the coronavirus and everybody's stuck inside doing a lot of people are doing DIY projects and everything, I want to talk about DIY nails because a lot of people, majority of people, can't go out to get their nails done because everything's shut down still. So today I want to share essential things that you need in order to do your nails at home. Because I've been doing my nails at home probably about a year, year and a half. I'm not a professional. I didn't go to school for this. Just just stuff that I, I learned throughout doing it, trial and error, and by looking at YouTube. Um, if you want to really do your nails at home, you want to get it right, you want to do a good job with it, I would uh, watch Long Hair Pretty Nails and Susie from Nail Career Education. Those are the two major ones that I would watch, that I do watch. So, let's get into the video. So the first thing that you should get if you're going to do your nails at home is, especially if you're going to do gel nail polish at home, you're going to need a LED UV gel lamp. Um, this has settings on the back so you can put it for 10 seconds, 30 seconds, 60 seconds, and 90 seconds. And then this is also a low heat setting because sometimes when you put your nails in a lamp like this, um, people know that you might get a heat spike. So then it burns your nails. So if you do the low heat setting, it should help with that. This I got on Amazon. I don't remember how much it is, but I'll link everything that I talk about here that I bought on Amazon, which is the majority of it. I'll link it down below. So I really like this one. It was it was pretty affordable and it works really well. The next thing you're gonna need if you're gonna do your nails at home and you're gonna use gel nail polish is nail polish. Now there's a lot of good nail polishes, gel nail polishes on Amazon that I've that I've gotten. And I do like them. They're they're good quality. Um they're not the well, they're not bad quality. So I would repurchase them if I had to. But um the company that I do like, it's a little bit more expensive, but you do get um good nail polish. And also it has afterpay, which afterpay is if you hit a certain amount, you can pay it off. So every two weeks it would a certain amount will come out of your account based on how much you spent during in that purchase. So that's good. The nail polish that I like, the brand, is called Kira Sky. And I do like this brand. It it works really well. Um, I'm using it now. I don't remember what color I have on it because I do have a lot of bottles. And they are in, they're just, I just keep them in the package that it comes in. Um, so yeah, you do get a lot. And they do have different ones. They have ones that... Oh, well, actually, the color that I'm wearing right now is called Manta Sea Green. It's like that, and then it looks like that. So I'm having on, like, these ones. That's what I have on now. And I do like this color. It is a halo um, one. But they do have ones that, like, change colors with temperatures, and then they have glow-in-the-dark ones as well. So they do have a big variety of um, um, nail polish, which is really good. Um, another thing. If you're going to do your nails and you're going to do like nail extensions or you're going to make them longer, um, I have tried acrylic and it's not bad, it's just I'm not professional again, so uh, it's hard for me to do. So what I suggest you do if you're going to do your nails at home is to get something like this, which this is the Kira Sky Jelly Tips and it's a whole set, it's a whole system. So it's an extension, but this is different than nail tips. Nail tips just go on the end of your nails and they just extend it. These are a full cover nail. They go from your cuticle all the way down and they're gel. So you don't have, it's, they're durable. They're more durable than a nail tip, which is made of plastic. So that's good. And it's, it's pretty much foolproof. You have the sizes here, and they come in size. They come in different shapes as well. They come in square, round, stiletto, and I got the coffin shape. And they come in size with small and medium. Um, and other brands do this too. I think I think it's called a Praise does it too. And there's another brand that does it too. 
but I'll link those below as well. And so this is you just you put the and it comes with a little lamp. Here it is with the lamp, which is amazing because it has that opening, so it's really easy to do your own nails. It's it's super easy, and they do last a long time. This set I have I recently did, but I just did a fill in, and they lasted for about three weeks. So you put the gel. I want to take a screenshot of that. You do the gel, and then you do the you put the gel in the tip, and then you place it on your nails, and then you put it in the lamp. That's it. Good. Take off the shiny letter, paint them, go. That's all you have to do with these. And they last long. So I would highly suggest these, which is the um Kira Sky Jelly Tips Soak Off Nails, which I think they're sold out, but jump on it when they're in stock. Another thing. So if you want to take off well if you want to do your own nails, I would suggest, especially with those, because you have to get the you have to dull the inside of a nail before you put it on. So I would suggest you gotta get a um a a nail drill. Get yourself a nail drill. It does help out when you want to change the color of the gel nails instead of soaking them all up because it takes a long time to soak up gel nails, especially like tips and acrylic as well. It also takes a long time to soak off. So I would suggest getting yourself a nail drill. This was inexpensive as well. I got it on Amazon. So I would suggest this. This is the um, Melanie Susie one. And you just get it like this. It's really cute. It's small. So I would suggest this one. And then on top of that, if you need to do your own nails, you gotta get drill bits for the drill. So this is just a holder that I have, and these are just some of the drills that I have. You see those. Because you want to get the coarser ones, like this one. And the coarse just means the um how the, the drill looks. And yeah, these are also again on Amazon. Well, I will look in the bottom, in the description below. And then just just regular simple things like um lint free wipes free nails so you don't get the dust everywhere. Ugh. If you use cotton balls, you know that there's like the the fibers get in the nails and it's just, just a pain in the ass. So I was sort of seize again, Amazon. And then nail yeah, files. So these are just buffers. I got these on a set on Amazon for like not that much of that at all. Not that much at all. So I just see as well. And if you want to get fancy with doing your nails, you can get stuff like this, which is nail foils. And then you get a kit. There's a kit that can come as well, which is like this, the Marquette um nail foil art set. It has foil in it and the blue and then all the directions. So this is really good too. I was I suggest this as well. I'll leave this down below as well. Um and um yeah. So that's just some things that I think that if you want to do your nails at home helps to do it. It it it's um it's not that hard to do at home, especially with the jelly nail system. So I suggest all of that and everything will be linked down below because everything was pretty much affordable and on Amazon if you want to do your nails at home. Um, and if also, also if you want to get fancy with it, you can also get like um, alcohol ink so you can do like stuff like that. And there's stickers as well that you can get which really makes it fun and um, it's, it's not that hard to do your nails at home. It's really not. So. Thank you for watching and hit the subscribe button and the like button.